What's good everyone? It's 80 the chosen one back with another video. Now we all know 2023 is coming up and I want to give you all some motivation about your health, and most of all about fitness and how to be and gain the best of your potential. Be at your best potential with fitness that you can possibly be at. Alright, so we're gonna get right into it. 2023. Now, a lot of people have New Year resolutions that they do not stick to. We all know this. But I think that I think that 2023 will be different for a lot of people because I'm feeling it. I don't know about y'all, but I'm feeling it. But the whole point of this video is to tell you, you, and you how to stay fit in 2023, all right? So we're going to get right into it. I have a couple pointers. It's not going to be a long video. I just want to get this out so you all can be ready for 2023 because I'm ready. And I want to make sure my followers, my supporters, my fans, my family is ready with me. So without further ado, let's get into it. Now, the number one way, the number one thing you can do to stay fit in 2023 is stop stressing. Don't stress. You just have to do it. Make it your lifestyle because a lot of people is good with fitness. They are. A lot of people can work out and do good, but for them, it's just a hobby. It has to become your lifestyle. And how do you do that? Stop stressing. You cannot make fitness your lifestyle if you don't have any room for it. Throw away some of that stress and become your full potential. Just like I said earlier, I'm trying to help you get to your best potential with fitness, especially in 2023. So number one, stop stressing, all right? Let's move on to number two on how to stay fit in 2023. Okay, guys, now number two is something <laughs> that I say a lot that you may hear everyone say. But I'm going to switch it up on y'all. Now, the first one I say is stop stressing. Number two, which a lot of you people may think is number one, which is everyone's biggest problem, is staying consistent. But how do you stay consistent is stop stressing. I'm not here to tell you all these different tips and put a throw a bunch of, throw a hundred pieces at you and just suspect you because no human, no human being is perfect and just suspect you to do all these things at once. That's unrealistic. So I'm going to connect all of these. Number two, be consistent. You do that by less stress. So with an increase in stress, what happens is that these chemicals in your brain release and you're going to do whatever comforts you to relief, to relieve that stress. But if you don't have any stress, you can stay consistent and don't do what is comfortable, but do what is good. Do what is productive. OK, that is how that connects right there. And that's how it's going to help you stay fit in 2023. Now let's move on to number three on how it's going to help you stay fit in 2023. Okay, guys, now number three is something that I try to do every now and then. I try to do it, and, and that is, it sounds crazy, but that is working out at all times. Now, when I say that, I'm actually going to switch it. Number three, stay active. Stay active. That's how, that is how you cannot get off track. You don't have to be in the gym or working out every day, but stay active. Let's say if you're having an, an off day, a rest day, still go play your favorite sport. Go walk the dog. Stay active. But if you just fall off and go to sleep, you can take a little cat nap. You can take a mini nap. But if you just fall off and go to sleep, you're not going to stay fit in 2023. You have to stay active. I know that's where a lot of people may have messed up in the year 2022, but it's okay. We got another year, baby. It's okay. It's okay. We still go get fit physically and mentally. Being fit physically helps you mentally. We still going to get fit. We still going to thrive in the end. It does not matter. It doesn't matter, okay? So it's okay. This right here is your chance, all right? Stop stressing. Be consistent and stay active active with all of those things be productive be 
productive. That is how you're going to stay fit in 2023. Do hobbies that you love. That's being productive because once you're active, that's energy, all right? So let's say if you love cooking, all right, but whenever you're not working out and you start cooking, that's bringing good energy towards you. Now you want to go kill the workout. So the whole key to staying fit in 2023 is staying fit mentally with your life. Staying productive. That is all it is to it. And watch, if you do those things, again, it's simple and short. I'm not here to overload you. I'm not here to um, make your New Year's resolution and mark even more stuff down. No, I'm here to make it simple for you but also tell you a way to be productive and see those results. So thank you all for watching. Comment down below what you all think about the video and what's your plans for 2023. Like and share this video to somebody else that you know is looking forward to going into a better year of 2023, all right? So thanks for watching. Stay safe. I love y'all. Peace out. Go get fit. Most of all, stay fit.